Hi friends, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Today we have to discuss about NPTEL problem solving through programming in C, week 11, assignment 11 answers. The due date for this assignment is 12-10-2022. The first bit is which are true about interpolation first one it is a process for finding a value between two points on a line or curve second one interpolation provides a mean for estimating functions at intermediate points so ans option a is only one option b is only two option c is both one and two option d is none of the above so answer is option c next second question a lagrange polynomial passes through three data points as given below x value is 10 15 20 f of x value is 19.45 10.63 7.82 the polynomial is determined as f of x is equal to l naught x into 19.45 l1 x into 10.63 plus l2 x into 7.82 the value of f of x at x is equal to 12 is option c 15.20 third question the value of integral 0 to 3 x square into e power 2 x dx by using one segment trapezoidal rule is answer option a 5446.3 fourth one to solve the ordinary differential equation 10 into dy by dx plus x square into e power x is equal to y cos of x plus x sin of y where y naught is equal to 5 using runge kutta fourth order method the equation is rewritten as so option c dy by dx is equal to 1 by 10 into y cos x plus x sin y minus x square into e power x y naught is equal to 5 next fifth bit given 4 into dy by dx plus x square is equal to y cube y of 0 0.5 is equal to 2 and using a step size of h is equal to 0 0.2 find the value of y of y of 0 0.7 using runge kutta fourth order method is so fifth one is answer is option b 2.5546 next sixth question what will be the area under the curve using the trapezoidal rule is so x value is 1.4 where y value is 4.3215 x value is 1.6 y value is 4.7428 x value is 1.8 y value is 5.5205 x value is 2 y value is 6.0525 x value is 2.2 y value is 6.8762 so answer is option a 4.3829 next seventh bit the real root of the equation 5x minus 2 cos x minus 1 is equal to 0 up to 2 decimal accuracy is so answer is option d 0 0.532 to 0 0.56 next Eighth bit, which is a false among the three statements. First one is the bisection method is guaranteed to work for finding roots of all continuous functions. Trip op option two, trapezoidal rule is a te technique for approximating the indefinite integral. Third one is Lagrange polynomial is used for polynomial uh, interpolation. So answer is option d none of the above are false
ninth one find the root of x square minus x minus 10 equal to 0 approximately up to 5 iterations using bisection method that a is equal to 1.5 and b is equal to 2 so answer is option c 1.86 tenth bit match the following here newton method is used for finding the roots lagrangian polynomial is used for finding interpolation trapezoidal rule method is used for finding integration runge kutta method is used for finding differential equation so answer is option a so now again once again i am telling the answers so first one is option c second one is option c third one is option a fourth one is option c fifth one is option b sixth one is option a seventh one is option d eighth one is option d ninth one is option c tenth one is option a click on submit answers So thank you for taking week 11 assignment. So this is the week 11 assignment answers a video. So thank you for watching this video. If you really like this video, click on the like button and share this video to your friends and classmates. If you like this video, please subscribe my YouTube channel, Dibbela Srinivasarao. If you have any doubts, please put your doubts in the comment section. I will try to clarify your doubts. And uh, week 11 programming assignment is already uploaded. Please check the answers. Thank you. Thank you for watching this video.